like the gloves were like floating in the air. This thing is bugging me, so I have to kill it. Let's use our ring. And it's dead. Hello everyone! My name is Garrett O'Camber, and welcome to Morrowind. Sorry, I was just looking at my feet there, which are non-existent except for that green circle, which is just awesome. I am trying to learn restoration, but it is taking me forever. I will definitely need training in this. Hi there. Can I kill you? Can I kill you, please? Die. Thank you. Shit. Okay. Gaining skills is not a bad thing because you're going to need a variety of different skills to succeed in this game. Hey, restoration to level 12. That only took forever. Let's never do that again, shall we? Maybe I can cast Soul Trap. What's my chance to cast Soul Trap? 35% chance to use. That sounds great. Um, let's equip a sword so we have a chance of actually capturing something. I hear you. I hear you. Where are you? Oh, he's wiggle whooping. Oh, he's doing things. That sucked. That sucked. Oh god, he's spraying green shit on me. Stop it. There we go. Your show will belong to me. Come on. Give me your soul. If you want to. Yay, I've trapped his soul. Yay, karma. That's awesome. Hey, let's actually try using it. We're gonna fail, but, you know... It's not that bad. Um, let's put it on a common ring. And let's make it deal fur damage. Okay. Common ring of fire. Yes, when use. Oh, and I actually did it. That's awesome. And that just boosted our uh, enchant skill up. Holy damn! <laughs> oh, wow! <laughs> that almost went all the way up. That's really cool. So we just made a ring for two to three points of damage on touch. That's so cool. Um, pretty damn proud of that. That was the first time I tried this since I've been playing this game in forever. And, uh, you know, it's not as strong as that, but it's definitely, um... Well, it's it's something, I mean. It's a start. Damn. Let's use that ring we just made. I'm sorry, but your life ends here, little creature. Oh, yeah. That's awesome. Oh, that's so cool. I feel particularly proud of that one there. And our athletics just went up, which is decent. Okay. Well, you know that works. When it works, it works. Um, I just realized I could have used the Mage's Guild to get here, but whatever. <laughs> so I did the last time. I just ported around the map um, where it lets you port. Uh, you can port from here, you know, to like here. Um... There's places over here you can go. There's even Heart down here, which I haven't been to yet. It's a pretty cool place. Um, I'm excited to get past level 10 to go to Solstheim, because if I go there now, I'm going to get destroyed. But, you know, for the most part, I think we're doing pretty okay. I want to show you another miracle of modding. This is going to be cool. Might be a little shocking. As I lost my face! Oh my god! Uh, it's a skull of things! Um, I'd like to take this moment to talk about how difficult it was to get this stuff in the game. Uh, so somebody made uh, JoJo's um, Lich King armor for Morrowind. And you see me wearing it now, but you're probably like, Oh, well that's easy, it's just a mod you download. No, it's a mod you download from another country the guy didn't properly port. In fact, there was textures missing. I had to add them myself. I actually had to refit the armor because the guy who made the mod apparently didn't have a very good grasp on how to add it to the game. And, uh, like, the gloves were, like, floating in air. This thing is bugging me, so I have to kill it. Let's use our ring. And it's dead. Um, but, like, the gloves, my hands were gone 
and they would be floating out into space like that. Half the textures weren't even porting in, like the cape, the the curious, the greaves, and um, the helmet were all missing textures that do not exist anywhere. Uh, so I had to add in those textures myself. I looked for multiple versions of the mod, and I couldn't find any multiple versions. There was only one in existence, and I don't even remember the website I got it off of. It was pretty dodgy. Whatever the fact is, I have the Lich King armor. Now, as for the helmet, I had to completely... I don't know if you could see the pinpoints of light there between all the blue fire coming off of him, but I had to put in my own textures for the eyes because they were non-existent, and that was a bitch to do. Thankfully, I know how to mod now. I'm pretty badass at doing it, and for doing it for... Oblivion and Skyrim. I got very adept at doing it for this game. I added in the skull myself from another mod that changes the Lich um, in the game. It, cha it Well, sorry. It makes a new kind of Lich that you can become. However, I don't use that mod, so I couldn't use the Lich. However, the face, the head, I was more than willing to want to get. And the head was this glowing skull there with the animated jaw, and it gives off this blue stuff. So I wanted to give the Lich King helmet that, uh, sorry, I'm just gushing about how, how difficult this was, but it was very difficult. It took me several days to get to work. There is a naked guy right there. Hello, Mr. Naked Guy. Am I not just the most terrifying thing you've Someone ever seen? should teach you some manners. I will kill you. <laughs> no, um, I, uh, yeah, it took me a while to get all this stuff to work, so I'm pretty proud of that. However, here's the thing. While I'm wearing this helmet, I have Increased. I thought I had increased enchant. No, I have increased magicka while I wear it, and I should be able to use Eldritch Farging. And so now, I can try to forge an awesome item. As I would like to make an enchanted item. Nothing too spectacular, but something just good enough. Um. Let's make our silver longsword have an enchantment on it, shall we? Hmm. I could make this constant effect. Or no, cast when strikes. Restore health on me. and that will actually restore my health as I attack, which is really cool. Uh, Silver Longsword, uh, eh, you know, let's give it a unique name. Um, Silver Moon. Come on, come on, come on. Yay, we made it. Silver Moon. Whenever I strike, Wait, what the hell? What was that? Oh, okay, yeah, the drain health effect from Eldritch Forging. I forgot about that. Uh, so now what this should do is every time I attack, it should heal me. If it doesn't, I fucked up, and, uh, yeah. It should heal me, though, every time I strike an enemy. Which is really cool! Um, now naturally, you wouldn't be this powerful early on in the game, but considering I don't know how long the series will go on, I would love to make this a very lengthy series, you know, like seeing a level 50 character above. And it works! That is awesome. I will not be dying as much with this thing. Ah! <laughs> I've already got crazy awesome armor. Uh, I'm not going to keep the helmet on for now. Um... Primarily when I finally turn or things like that. I'm gearing myself up for a lot of the higher level content that I've added to the game, including the mods. Oh, it's an angry bar. I'm sorry. You have to die. Oh, I'm sorry, buddy. You're just, you're just too beautiful for this world. I had to kill you. I'm sorry. Um, the thing is... This is definitely cheating, and I'll admit that, but I've done this in all my series. I've added content that I have customized into the game for the sole purpose of keeping the game as fresh and interesting as it can be for me, because my experience is not going to relate to your experience. And what the hell are you doing? There is a person here. Hi. How are you? Oh, How that's the girl with up to something devious. blinding speed boots. And she won't talk to me because, uh... Let's change your mind. 
No. She just, she's, she's below the, um, <laughs> she's be below the quest threshold. She has enchanted boots on that are making her blind, and she wants me to lead her to a place. I would like, I would like to do this quest, but I don't know if I can. Yeah, she really hates me. Um, I, oh, no. Oh, no, never mind. Never mind. I just had to restart the game. Okay, because I got her persuasion up before to 50 off camera just to see if I could do it. And I was like, that isn't working, and now she wants to make a deal. Okay, I can take you to Narmok. Excellent. <laughs> they are not a wondrous thing, but, um... They are they okay. They are a, a, a really uh, neat. Yeah, she wanted to go to Narmok. That's right. Narmok. Okay. Yeah. She wants to go to Narmok. So that's straight in this direction. The thing is, the boots of blinding speed are a wondrous uh, magical item. They're unique, but uh, they are not what they appear to be, and I will not ruin the surprise. But uh, you might be able to guess. She has a really nice axe, by the way. I want it. That's actually that's something I would like to have. But my sword is stronger. Ow. What the hell is attacking me? Oh, it's a rat. Fucking rats. Okay. Rat's dead. Rat's dead. That's good. Um, you know, I'd like I'd like to have what she has there. Uh the uh very, very, very nice axe, but at the same time I have a really nice weapon that I just made. And honestly, you won't find one better for a while. You know, in comparison to this, so... You know. There's certain enchanted weapons that are just superior to any other. And this is one of those weapons that I happen to have created. I'm very proud of that. Another thing, too, is I can make more money off of items that I find by enchanting them and selling them, selling them to people. So, that's a very good strategy that I will soon adopt. I have to find a way over these mountains, or these hills, because I'm not going to get there anytime soon. The squar is making gruntling noises. Guar. 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 Oh my god. Oh, the gruntling is real. I'm so scared. I'm so scared of the cuteness. Oh, the gruntling. Ah, we're on our way to Narmok. Oh, how beautiful is that? Uh, yeah, it's just down this way here. There's a bull netch there. He may attack us. You're gonna be peaceful? You're gonna be peaceful. That's right, the Betty Netches are the ones you have to watch out for. They're, they're little assholes. Um, Uh-oh. I seem to have lost my woman. Come back here. She was just behind me, I swear. Oh, I swear. She was she was right there. Come here. Shit. What's your problem? God. Come on, let's get you, let's get you to your town so you can give me my boots that I'll probably never use. As awesome as they sound. Because I know better. What the hell are you doing? Follow me, you dumb shit! Oh, uh, this is another thing. The pathfinding in this game was something to be desired, but, you know, for the time, this was an amazing game. It's still an amazing game, it's just... Hey, 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 hey. Hey. Come on. Come. Follow me. Well, don't, don't you turn around. Don't you turn around. Come on. Let's go. Let's do this. The boat's right there. I can see it. I can see it because of this awesome mod that lets me see across the map for once. Yes. Yes. Come on. Let's go. God, please don't get stuck on a route or drown or something like that. That can happen. They can drown. I could fail this quest hardcore. It would be a very sad day for everyone, but it'll happen. We'll watch it. Oh, speaking of watching it. Can you even hit that thing with that axe? What level are you? I'm just gonna gain all my life back every time I attack this thing. Ow! 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 Stop! There we go. It's dead. Okay, let's go. Follow me. I know where I'm going. Maybe. Hey! Ah. <sighs> You are now the owner of the boots of blinding speed. <laughs> oh, this is good. So, how you doing? Thanks for your help. Oh, shit. 
<laughs> Just an honest trader. Yeah, she's honest. She's honest, all right. You robbed me blind. Okay. So what do you want? Well, let's see what these do. You ready? Oh my god, I can't see anything. Now, if you look at the bottom right hand corner, you will see me moving at a ridiculous speed. And that is because they are the boots of blinding speed. And I will take off the boots now and place them in my boots. Where the hell am I? I was over there about a second ago. It's right there. Now I'm over here. That's why they call them the boots of blinding speed, because they have 100% blindness. But your speed goes up by 200 points, I mean. You need to run away from something, you know? You just run in the direction you can't fucking see. It's like, I don't know where I'm going, but I'm so super fast. <sighs> oh shit! What did I do? I'm sorry! Leave me alone. Oh my god. What did I even do? Okay, so some of them do attack you. That's awesome. Hi. You have killed a breeding niche. Um. That's bad, I would assume. Wasn't aware of that. Okay, did I earn, like, a bounty for that or something? Hey, it just tried to attack me, so, I mean, fuck it. I mean, if a netch gets in your way, you just say, Hey, tentacle beast, get out of here, I don't like you. And it should die in a fire. Or in that case, poison with frost. What the hell is that over there? There's, like, some sort of scaffolding or something. I'm curious now. What's going on? What are you? The dead... <gasps> Ow! <laughs> This is a dead, uh, war. Interesting. Let's build it. You guys? Okay. Strange that mud crabs would kill me. I don't know. Either creature. Okay. I'm just gonna, you know, do horrible things to you with my spells and stuff. And you are now dead. Praise be the Lich King. Rawr. That's a spooky looking tree. Oh my god. Oh, this is Cartag Point. I haven't been here in God knows how long. This has been a very long time. I can't even remember, to be honest. Oh, it's memories. Hey, you're just doing cliff racer things. Get away from me. What are you doing? Are you... Okay, he's gone, apparently. Building crate there. I don't like this area. Am I gonna be able to get back on the land? Probably not. Ow! What? Oh, it's a fish. Come on, just die already. Die! Oh god, I'm not, not, I don't have enough strength to kill him. Uh. Wait, there's a. A reflection of something in the water that isn't there. It's like the scaffolding that I saw before is just not here for some reason. It's weird. Well, anyways, I'm gonna get off here for now. This will be the end of this episode, and in the next episode, I will not fall off this cliff because that would be bad. No, in the next episode, we'll see where the road takes us. Thank you so much for watching, Marwind. Thank you so much for commenting and subscribing. If you have, if you have it, take a look at some of my other stuff. Make your on this, you know, decision. Is my channel worth it? <laughs> I think it is. I think I, I offer some weird, stupid things from time to time. Um, so, yeah, we'll see where the road takes us, and I cannot pass through here. This sucks. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you all.